I usually don't do Photoshop tutorials, uh, but I actually needed to create some 3D text and then I realized maybe I could just make a tutorial about that as well. So I'm going to delete this and start from scratch. So let's say I have some text like I'm going to use distort because that's the name of the tool that I'm going to use for this tutorial. And basically what you want to do is create some text, place it where you want it. Um, go to control T. Uh, now one thing with text is that you will see that we cannot distort text as long as it's still in the text form. So what I mean is that we need to go to layers and go and um, rasterize it to merge it into image form. Now at this point when you select it and go control T go right click you will see that now we have distort option available and so go ahead and do that and create your 3D text this way um, yeah maybe something like this so now that I have my text the way I wanted I'll go ahead and while holding alt key I'm gonna also keep pressing the up arrow on the keyboard and I'm gonna do that continuously several times so you'll see I created all these copies and I'm gonna select them with shift and then I'm gonna hit control E control E will merge them into one but notice I left out one on purpose so I'm gonna move it up and I'm gonna hit control I to invert the text and I'm gonna move it up a little bit and so basically this is really the technique um, for creating 3d text in Photoshop you can use other effects like let's say skew you know obviously you would do that before this um, step but in different situations you might want to use um, something else depending on what kind of 3d text you want to create you might also want to experiment with gradients for the back side of your text um, so basically what you want to do is you want to select everything except your top part and just apply a gradient or you can also rotate it something like that so basically that's how you want to do this effect